In this video I'm going to show you how to generate some cross tables also known as contingency tables. So we'll analyze the descriptive statistics and then cross tabs. I'll reset it so it's the same as you started. Now let's say I want to see the comparison of gender so that goes into the columns based on their favorite brand. And I might want to see some percentages as well so under cells I want to see how many, but I also want to see the percentage based on the column total. And the columns are then the gender total. So we'll do it based on the males and the females separately. Continue and OK. As you can see, 50% of the males, 4 divided by 8, uh, likes Nike. And 34%, 15 over 44, of the females like Adidas. If I would have chosen the row totals, it would have done 4 over 10. And if I would have done the grand total, then it would have been 4 over 52. There's another way of generating this table. You can go for analyze tables and use custom tables. The advantage here, reset, all tabs, is that I can again use my multiple response set that I defined earlier. This is about TV series, so this goes into the rows and it's still gender. Please look at my previous videos to show how you can create such a multiple response set. Click on OK. I can nicely see that uh, four males actually indicated that they like Game of Thrones and 24 females indicated that they like South Park. You can also use the alternative way for multiple response sets. If these two are not activated, that means you haven't defined a variable set yet. Go for frequencies, uh, sorry, cross tabs. I'll reset it. Gender goes into the columns, but I have to define the range. Now I've assigned one to male and two to female, and that's it, so one till two. And I want in the rows the TV series. The advantage here is I can easily pick again my column percentages and I can assign if it's based on the percentages on the responses or on the cases. I want it to be based on the cases because I want to know how many percent of the males actually selected it. Continue and OK and now nicely get an overall table. Note that these percentages do not add up to 100% so if you report a table like this Please also note that underneath that, because this was a multiple answer question, the percentages do not add up to 100%. Thank you.